हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल नोशन ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स इन टूडेज वीडियो आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग द टॉपिक ऑफ एग्जैक्ट डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशंस सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग हियर व्हाट इज द फॉर्म ऑफ दिस एग्जैक्ट डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन इफ एनी इक्वेशन इज रिटेन एम एक्स वाई डी एक्स प्लस एन एक्स वाई डी वाई is equal to 0 or in short if we are writing it m dx plus n dy is equal to 0 then when this type of equation is known as exact differential equation so for that purpose there is a condition which is to be fulfilled what is the condition partial m by partial y is equal to partial n by partial x if for such equation partial derivative of capital m with respect to y is equal to partial derivative of capital n with respect to x then we will say that this equation is an exact differential equation and if any equation is exact differential equation so for that particular equation this is a predefined solution what is that predefined solution let me write it its solution and this solution is only for exact differential equation this solution is integration m dx plus integration n dy is equal to constant along with sub conditions what is the condition for first integration y will be treated like constant term and in second integration whatever is capital n that should be free that should be free from variable x so first of all we will check the condition of exactness if that is fulfilled then we will talk about the solution of that exact differential equation but this particular concept will be clear with the help of one question so that is why i am going to discuss one question here so question is like x square x square minus 4xy minus 2y square dx plus y square minus 4xy minus 2x square dy is equal to 0 so here we have to verify i mean to say we have to just deal with two parts first is suppose this is equation 1 first is verify exactness verify exactness of what exactness of this differential equation and second then find the solution of that particular exact differential equation so students first of all we will compare this equation with capital m dx plus capital n dy is equal to 0 where capital m is what it is coefficient of dx and capital n is what it is coefficient of dy so separately i can write it so capital m is here x square minus 4xy minus 2y square and capital n is y square minus 4xy minus 2x square now i will be applying the formula of solution of exact differential equation that is integration m dx plus integration n dy is equal to constant and for first integration y is constant and for second integration n must be n must be free from variable x now see students i will be putting the values of this capital m and capital n here so it is integration of what is capital m i am putting it here x square minus 4xy minus 2y square dx plus and here integration n dy is equal to constant but in n in capital n what terms we should write we should only write those terms which are free from x so you see this is not free from x this is also not free from x only this y square term is free from x so i will be writing here y square and as i told you that in this first integration 
I will be uh, treating y is a constant term. Okay, so now we will integrate this particular term. So integration of x squared is x cube by three minus four. Y is a constant, and integration of x is x squared by two minus two. Y squared is a constant, and integration of dx is x. And plus integration of this term y squared is y cube by three is equal to constant. Or it is little bit more simplification is required. X cube by three minus two x squared y. Minus 2xy squared plus y cube by 3 is equal to constant term. Thereafter, what we can do? We can take 3 LCM. So it will be x cube minus 6x squared y minus 6xy squared plus y cube is equal to 3c. Or I can write it x cube minus 6xy is a common term, and it is x plus y. Plus y cube is equal to thrice of c, and thereafter one thing, one more thing we can do. Consider thrice of c is a new constant c dash. So that will be uh, now written like this: x cube minus 6xy, x plus y, plus y cube is equal to c dash. So this is the final answer of that exact differential equation. So one more time, I will recall the process. If any equation is of this type, m dx plus n dy equal to zero, and if this condition is fulfilled, partial m by partial y is partial n by partial x, then solution of exact differential equation can be written directly, like integration m dx plus integration n dy is equal to constant, and in the first integration y is constant, in the second integration it should be free from x, and thereafter one question is discussed. and in this question the whole process is incorporated i hope students this video will be very helpful for you thank you so much for watching this video